What is going on guys, DBG here, and today we got a new free Galaxy Opal, and I haven't actually done a gameplay with this card, and I think he could be kind of interesting. Wait, do I not have him as an open pack? I could have swore I had him as an open pack. There we go. There he is. There he is. And I've not done a gameplay with this guy yet, and I'll be interested just to see how he's uh, how he is in game. So, I mean, we had a gameplay with him on the, uh, JC did a gameplay with him, and that's it. So not even one on the Debo channel. Not even one from the Debo. So he might, like, as far as my point guards go, like, I got Denny Westbrook, and it's between him and Dane, really. It's going to be between him and Dane for that third spot. So 6-3, but you've got T-Rex Arms on Monte Ellis. Uh, worse dunker, worse shooter, but he might have better release. I mean, he looks to be worse at literally everything than them. He looks slightly worse at everything. With five less Hall of Fame. He doesn't range. He does look to be slightly worse at everything, though, than Dame. And, man, I'm... I'm very, very disappointed with the fact that, like... We're, it's not looking like we're getting two-week events anytime soon. 2K love, like, bringing something we want into the game and then taking it away. What escape is that? Uh, not really. I'm not feeling that one. Because I'm really not feeling that release right there. So Monte Alice has got the uh, pro escape. I said the iron size, was it? That release isn't terrible. It's book nights, nice, 38. I don't mind Book Knight release. Um, normal leaner. Torian Prince upper looks very much. It looks very nice though. I don't know. I feel a Book Knight release. It's like I don't like it on some players. And I do like it on others. The problem is this card is really is T Rex arms more than anything. Oh no! Can he? Can he dunk? Can he? Okay, there we go. It's like I held down on the analog stick. I don't know what happened. He can save dunk, thankfully. So yeah, Monte Ellis should be all right, I guess. And Book Knight release at least is easy to green. He's just inconsistent with his feet. It's like the old 38. It's just obviously they slowed down 38 to a freaking snail's pace over the last couple of years. What was the best release in NBA 2K20? Was fine in 2K21. Was okay in 2K22. And is not good in 2K23. Every year it gets slightly worse. Okay, so we're going to go and put in... Put Monte in. Um, Tony Allen. Because Tony Allen clamps. And then we've got Rudy. We have got Kevin Garnett. And we have got Lord Dino. We have got the Lord Dino fella. That man is the best. He is the best. Hopefully we can find the game. Like, it is 11 p.m. It is 11 p.m. So I'm like, it's not like it's late or anything. Okay, we found a game quick enough. Um, we should just be able to put Tony Analyst Penny and have him completely clamped at that stage. Yeah, if we lose this game, it's going to be a bad look on Monte Ellis here. If we lose this game, it's going to be a really bad look on him. Can't believe we, like, we literally have... A full team, but no Yee Yalen. We don't have the guy we're named after. Maybe? Okay, that's off. Good defense. Tony Allen clamps. Tony Allen clamps. Gub dunk there by uh, Monte Ellis. Come on. Okay, we got him. We got him. Let's chill. Oh, that would have been a nice dunk there. Run. Run. Run, Dino. Leaner. Give me that one, Monte. Come on. Alright, this is a... Should be a fairly easy one. And um, we just let LeBron add one on us. Layups go in at a crazy rate right now. They hotfix layups. I've made like four or five red layups today already. I played two clutch time games before this. I'm not joking. In those two close time games, I think I made four reds combined. 
dunk it. Oh, nice. Do a pull up and let go. I didn't, did not realize in clutch time you can get caught for hanging around for too, for too long. Well, that's a brick. Let's run. Let's hit Monte Alice. Okay, we're good. Oh, he missed the dunk. He missed the dunk right there. He went dunk meter and he missed it. That's way off. And that's a board from... I think it was Diamond Shack just that rebound. That's not good enough. Oh, wow, he finally greened. He should have greened that. Unless that's with a absolute bomb version of Kevin Durant, he should have greened that. Oh, what's he doing? That should be green. There we go. I don't know why he's backing off that much. Did Monte drop 40? If I really tried, I could probably get that 40-point game requirement in this. Oh, great defense, Dino. If that was other years, Dino would have just clotheslined them. If anyone knows about Dino, that man used to... That man used... Like, the fact that... He would commit crimes on defense. With how hard he'd, be, he'd hit people. He would absolutely destroy anyone who walked near him. Okay. I see you, Monte Ellis. He's not quite on track, but... We could fluke the 40. I don't know what he's trying to do here. Yeah, this is definitely a moderately new player to this game. Give me that. Green. Come on. There we go. At least this release is super easy to time. I'm not going to say it's the best release in the world because it's slow. It is super easy to time. He kind of reminds, he just reminds me of like Mac McClung. That's just what he feels like. He just feels like a worse version of Mac McClung. And like, I don't mind Mac McClung. I know some people hate him. Uh, he's Mac McClung with a better leaner and slightly worse player builds. The chat. There we go. And why are you pressing me? I, that should have been green. Why did I get the why did I get a speed up jumper? There we go. Let's run. Get into his hands. Get into his hands. Let's walk him back. Is he really send a double on that? Give me that. That's a four. That's brick. There we go. That should be green. What? That is definitely a white. Yep. Oh, that's a that's great defense by Tony Allen right there. I was just unlucky with the steal. Okay, yeah, we're definitely not hitting the 40. We missed a lot of shots that last possession. And to be fair, if we'd hit the hit that shot, we'd still only be just halfway there. And Lord Dino is on the line. Let's knock these down. Here's the first. And Dino, two for two, come on. That fade can be so hell if you can time it right. Like I, I am on ball that and literally just, he got three feet of space. He just missed a shot. What? That's also a new animation in the game. That happens at least once every game now, where you just will not make a chess pass. You will chuck the ball way out of bounds. I love when they like hot fix the game and don't tell anyone. That's my favorite part about the gameplay devs. Like layups now go in and you, half the time you will pass the ball out of bounds. Do I really have to hit Tony Allen? Oh, all right. All right, next possession. I'm just going to hit Tony Allen if you double team me. Tony Allen can hit shots, so I'm just going to use him. Like, I didn't even need to put Tony Allen on ball to win this game. Oh, well, that's a brick. Let's go. Let's get into his hands.
Hit him from deep. No, it's not. It's a little bit late. Yeah. 5% curve on that. You're not making that. Maybe Splash and make that, not me. Screw it, let's leak out. Run him right back outside. I actually thought that could have been open. Oh, it's a steal. All right, so decent win right there. Is he worth getting? I mean, if you get him via Ascension, he's fine. He is maybe the like eighth best point guard in my team. I'm not even joking on that one. And Dame's not even my third best point guard. Like, I cannot stress that enough. Like, Dame is there because, well, I very rarely play Unlimited. And I'd rather have fun and lose Unlimited. But, um, he's not better than Denny. He's not better than Westbrook. He's not better than Dame. He's not better than Alvarado. Probably better than CP3. He's not better than Dennis Johnson. You know, Dennis Johnson, you're my third choice point guard. Why, why have I taken you out of my team? He's not better than Dim Witty. He's not better than Ivy. He's not better than Mac McClung. He's like the 40th, 30th best point guard in the game, maybe. I think I might be generous putting him as the 30th, 30th best point guard in the game, to be completely honest. But again, if you want Monte Alice, like if you, if you get him and you like using him, he's not terrible. Not great, not terrible.